user is quite frustrated because they believe that fatal blows should not exist in Mortal Kombat 1 or any supers in any fighting game for that matter. And they end their comment off by saying that Homelander's fatal blow on Wake Up is super annoying because it's completely safe. I hate to put you on blast, man, but that is actually incorrect. It is not completely safe. It is a bit hard to punish depending on who you're playing as, but it is punishable. And here are a couple ways that you might do it. As I showcase this, understand that Homelander is set to do a fatal blow and then immediately block as soon as he can. So when we connect the hits, you'll understand and see that they did not have time to block them. So one is just by simply jumping and characters like Liu Kang that have an aerial special, doing the aerial special would stay in the air longer. That way all the lasers miss like this. Oh, we see it out. We're gonna jump and do aerial special. Then get down, punish. Flawless blocking is also a great way to make sure you can dash and then punish after that because the flawless block won't push you as far back like this. There's the flawless block. There we go, dashed in, do for a combo. So you can jump and do an aerial special. You can flaw this block. And even if you don't flaw this block, most projectiles are fast enough to land and a lot of characters can combo off of enhanced projectiles. Here's how a simple one might look. We're just gonna block the entire thing. There we go. So there are multiple ways to punish Homelander's fatal blow. You gotta lab before you comment. <laughs> Otherwise I'm forced to prove you wrong. At least I hope this helps. And don't forget to subscribe here for more.